This is the most recent and best beginner-friendly Facebook ad 2024 video on YouTube. If you call this a complete Facebook ad manager set of course, then you're very correct. Now, what I do at the beginning of every year is to assume that there will be people like you who wants to understand everything about the Facebook ad, how to properly set up your Facebook ad and how to start running ad the correct way on Facebook. You should have your Facebook ad manager set up because this is where Facebook really recognizes you as a partner. So what I do in this course is that I'm going to use a brand new Facebook ad account to demonstrate and show you the complete step-by-step -step process of setting up your Facebook ad manager the very correct way. No one else does this on YouTube, so you should give this video a like for that. Also, if you don't set up your ad manager the right way, your account will be banned by Facebook eventually, and that is exactly what you don't want. Ask people whose ad accounts are banned, it can really be a terrible experience. So I am demonstrating everything about the Facebook ad setup using a brand new Facebook ad manager account. You really won't see this kind of video anywhere on YouTube because all the ad videos are done using old accounts that have already been set up long, long time ago. I recorded this video with an assumption that you know nothing about the Facebook ad. So this Facebook ad 2024 setup is for you, either you're a complete Facebook ad beginner, an intermediate, or a Facebook ad expert that wants to know what has changed on Facebook setup this year. Make sure you don't jump any aspect of this video and by the time we are done that your Facebook ad account is 100% ready to start running any kind of ad on Facebook. So if you're ready for this then let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is to make sure that you're logged in to your normal Facebook account as you can see on my screen. Then open a new tab on your browser and type in business.facebook.com forward slash overview. Okay, at this point, I need you to know that there are three layers that you must understand while setting up your Facebook ad account. The first is your Meta Business Manager or what we call the Ad Manager. The second is your business account and then the third is your Facebook ad account and some other important tools in Facebook ads that we call the assets. Your business manager is like the main building that houses everything about your Facebook business. Your assets are things like your ad accounts, your Facebook pages, your pixels, your connected WhatsApp and Instagram accounts. Everything is found inside your business account which is housed within the business manager. So let's go ahead and create our business manager, which automatically comes with our first business account. To do that, come here and click create an account. Type in your preferred business account name. As you can see here, your normal Facebook account name is automatically displayed here just to show that you are actually using your normal account to create this business account. Here, type in any of your active email account that you are certain you will be using for your business and you will be able to receive message in because a confirmation link will be sent to you. And once you do that, click submit. Then head over to your email inbox and a confirmation email would have been sent to you. So here is mine. I will go ahead and open and click this confirmation box. But just if in case you did not find this email in your primary inbox, then go ahead and check your socials. It should be there. Congrats. We are done creating our Facebook business account now. That was easy, right? So what we'll be doing next is to add our different business assets to our newly created business account. Facebook business assets are the tools that you will be needing to run a successful ad or what I call proper ad. The most important of them includes tools like your ad account, your business page, your WhatsApp account and your Instagram account. And once we add this asset to our business account, then the business will be ready to start running ad the proper way. So to start adding our asset, come here and locate the account tab. Just in case you were not redirected here automatically, just scroll down and click the settings icon and it should get you to this point. The first asset I want to add is my business page. So to do that, I will come to the account section here and then I'll click pages. And as you can see, this business account does not have any page yet. So I will click the blue hard button. 
Three options are presented to us here. I want to assume that you already have your Facebook page created before now. So I will just come over here and select the first option, which is to add a page. But if you don't have an existing page, then choose the third option and just follow the prompt to create a Facebook business page. It's straightforward and it's easy. And just if you are an agency, then you can request access to a page here. So I'll be using an existing page already created. So I will choose the first option. So here, I will type in the name of the page I want to add or go copy the page URL and come paste it in here. So as I type, you can see that the page is already suggested to me. So here is my page. So I will select it, click the blue hard page button. And congrats! And now we have added our first Facebook asset, which is our business page to this business account. So I'll go ahead and add Instagram account so that I can have access to run Instagram ad also. So I'll come back to the accounts tab again and locate Instagram. I'll click it. Again, click the blue hard button. Scroll down and click connect your Instagram account button. So once you see your Instagram profile, go ahead and click the continue button. And if you cannot identify your account, then click the switch account link and then identify the account that you want to connect. Sign into Instagram. So just go ahead and sign in and then your Instagram account will be added to this business account. And so you can use this business account to run Instagram ad. So also let's have WhatsApp account so that you can run WhatsApp ad. I mean, I guess WhatsApp ad is really becoming a very important one these days. But I want you to note here that you can only add your business WhatsApp account here. You cannot add the normal WhatsApp. So again, I will come back to the accounts tab and select WhatsApp. Add WhatsApp account. Select your country code and type in your WhatsApp number. continue now a verification will be sent to that number so get it and type it in here and then just go ahead and complete the connection now to the most important asset to add this will be our facebook ad account but since this business account is a brand new one which does not have any facebook ad account yet then we need to create a fresh ad account so to create a brand new ad account in this business account Locate add account here and click it. Come here and click the blue hard button. Again, three options will pop up. And since we are adding a new account here, I want to create a brand new account. So I will select the first create a new ad account option. Give your hard account a name. Select your most appropriate time zone. Choose your hard account currency. Next. Now this ad account will be used for my business account. So I will select this and click create. I will turn on all of these or just come here and turn on the full control option. Then here I will add me as the admin and click assign. Okay, this hard account is now active, so you can go ahead and add your payment information. That is your debit card information that you will be using to pay for this ad when you run them. But I will not be doing that right now, so I will just close and exit. The next asset will be the Facebook pixel, but I will not be doing that in this video because I already have a video where I showed you how to create a pixel in 2024 on Facebook. The video is currently displayed on your screen and I will also leave it in the video description. Secondly, I would love to show you a better tutorial about the Facebook pixels and how to use it in another video. So make sure that you subscribe to this channel so you get to see when I publish these videos. So now that your new Facebook business account is ready, you can just come here and then here you can run your first ad. You can just come here and click this. 
and then here you can start running your first ad. Of course, I will obviously be publishing more videos about how to run successful Facebook ads, so make sure that you turn on the alert bell so Facebook can notify you when I release these videos. Also, please do me a favor by liking this video right now as it helps the YouTube algorithm suggest this video to more persons looking for information like this on YouTube. Thank you, and I'll see you in my next video.